Feeding birds from a bird feeder can be an enjoyable activity for both the young and the old. It's fun to look out your window and see the birds feeding, but what about the deer? They'll come to your feeder as well, especially if it spills feed on the ground, as well as squirrels and rats and mice. And this is where we run into a major problem with bird feeders. Bird feeders attract mice and mice carry ticks. And these ticks can be very dangerous to the human population because you'll have to go to the doctor and use an antibiotic. And if you're not careful, it can kill you. And the prevalence of Lyme disease has spread. In 2001, you can see where the blue areas are on this map, how widespread it was. But 12, 13 years later, it spread to more and more areas throughout the nation. It's a serious pest. Ticks get on your skin, they blow up, sucking blood out of you. Not a very good prospect. What can we do to help prevent this? Well, there are things that you can do. Here are some tips for managing your bird feeder and bird feeding activities. Keep the bird feeder as far away from your house as possible. Second, keep it clean. Third, don't overfill it because that makes for more spillage. And the next idea for bird feeding is to use trees and shrubs that produce berries that are available for the birds in the winter. Then you won't have to rely on bird feed. At our farm, we feed birds with bushes that grow plentiful amounts of berries. And we also take care of the rats and the mice by using a lot of rat bait and mouse baits. And we put them in buildings and outdoors and outdoor areas where birds and other critters can't get the poison. Besides using copious amounts of rat bait and mouse bait on our farm to keep the, the mouse population down, we also use what's called a four-poster feeder. It's a specialized deer feeder that has four paint rollers on it that are coated with prithron. It's the same pesticide that you use on your dog or on your clothing to get rid of ticks. The feeder is a low volume feeder. It uses whole corn as the feed for the deer. Deer like corn. Since deer only eat a pound and a half of corn per deer per day, this feeder does not dispense a lot of feed and thus is a low cost way to help you prevent the spread of Lyme disease to your family. In a test plot, this feeder has been shown to be effective in reducing deer tick populations. In one study, it reduced the deer tick population by upwards to 98%. If you'd like to come and see our deer tick feeder, you can do so at Highland Hill Farm in Fountainville, PA. We also have these for sale. We also sell trees and shrubs that we grow on our farm as well. You can visit us at Highland Hill Farm in Fountainville, PA. We also have locations in Lenore, North Carolina and McNinville, Tennessee. Our phone number is 215-651-8329. At Highland Hill Farm, we raise over 200 different kinds of trees and shrubs, and we can ship as well as we can deliver and plant from many different places. We have locations in Fountainville, PA, Lenore, North Carolina, and McNinville, Tennessee. So call us at 215-651-8329 for all your tree and shrub needs. Thank you.